Hey guys. Hello. So we're up on Kings Island continuing the one year anniversary. We're going to treat ourselves to Firebirds wood fired grill. It smells fantastic out here. Yeah. Apparently this smells is like a, I want all the food. <laughs> apparently this is a national chain. Uh, we've never had it before, but I'll tell you what, you can smell the wood fire out here and it smells great. Oh, I don't know. Where you can take your drink out. Oh, it smells so good in here. Oh my gosh, that's worth it. Hey guys, I'm gonna walk around and show a little bit of this later, but you can see the wood fire they got going on here. Nice bar. This is too cool. Okay, they sat us down here. Boy, I'll tell you what, the menu looks pretty awesome. Got some wood fired steaks. Not sure what I'm going to get yet. Uh, the waitress is off getting her water. I'll tell you what. They got it a little bit of I'll everything. I'll walk around and show off some of this place here in a few minutes. Maybe wait till after dinner. Uh, this place looks amazing. Yeah. It smells like... Um, I mean, I'm real hungry, so I feel like you should have Yeah, everything looks good. Well, it looks really cool. I'm I'm like a, look at the wood fire. Yeah, it's a big open grill. Yeah. I'm going to show you guys all that here once we uh, get our stuff together. What would you say? I said, I hope you brought $5,000. <laughs> you know, yeah, this place isn't uh, cheap, but I'll tell you what. I've heard nothing but good things about it. I may go for that filet or maybe that aged ribeye. They just, they got everything here, guys. They got hamburgers. They say everything is fantastic. Uh, they say you can't go wrong. So far, the service has been awesome. We ain't going for the salads, that's for sure. Lobster spinach queso. Lobster spinach queso. Do you want to try that? Mmm. Ranch rings. I don't know, man. Everything looks good here. I love the way this place is set up. Uh, we're going to go back and check out that wood fire where they give, give it gives it their name there, Wood Fired Grill. But I wanted to show off some of the menu here. We'll let you know what we get here. And, uh, slow roasted prime rib. Man, that sounds great. Oh boy. I gotta say, my mouth is watering already. Yes. This is crazy. Uh, Give me all the food. I'm, I'm glad we picked this place. Yeah, it's good to try something different. It looks a little pricey, but you know what? I don't care. It's a special day. It counts pricey. Yeah. What do you get? I'm not sure. Would you like to talk about the sauce? It's called Java barbecue sauce. And I was like, what is that? <laughs> she said that it's got, it put coffee and something else in it. She was know, afraid like, it was going to taste like coffee. Does it taste like coffee? Like coffee? She I ordered coffee. barbecue ribs. Yeah, because I hate coffee and I didn't want to get one. It was going to taste like coffee. So she brought me a thing of it to taste. And it's not bad. Kinda, it's good. It's sweet. It's kind of got like a tangy note, like on the aftertaste. I mean, it's always weird eating barbecue sauce just plain. Barbecue sauce, so it'll probably be really like a big I ordered, I ordered the aged ribeye. It was a toss-up between that and the uh, prime rib. Prime rib. Already, I'm very impressed with the service here. Our waitress is awesome. She's really nice. Yeah. Okay, they let me in the back here so that I could. Film some of the awesome cooks back here. I'll tell you what, this smells fantastic. Oh, I would love to work here. <laughs> These guys are the real miracle workers. But yeah, that's how they do it. Pretty awesome. I wanted to show off this amazing bar here. One thing I'm curious about is how do they get to the top? They gotta have a pretty tall ladder to get up there. <laughs> it's real awesome theming here. And I'll tell you, they have wine bottles everywhere. More wine. And this is what I like about this place. They have all kinds of, like, art. Art all over the place. They just have these real random, awesome paintings all over the place. Really cool stuff. I also like it when they have these real nice party booths. Check out the chandelier thing. Too cool. I didn't even know this was included. What kind of bread is this? Really good bread. <laughs> really good, you say? It's good. It looks good. Did you 
you dip any in the barbecue sauce? Salt on the inside. Mm -hmm. That's good. There's crunchy on the outside. Mm, I've never had it at a restaurant before. Yeah. No, it's good. It, it tastes like, like real like homemade bread. bread. That's what it tastes like. It smells like everything. Like bread that's been like in a machine all day. Our waitress was saying that everything they do here is in house. Mm -hmm. Even the sauce. So they make everything. their own dressings and sauces and everything. Try some with a little butter here. I will try some of a little bit of that Java barbecue sauce. Mm. Mm. That is good. It like tones it down a little bit so it's not so tangy. I don't like that noodle. Well, what do you think? I want to get prepared. Oh, we minutes. should probably show them the food. So I got the 14 ounce aged ribeye, and I gotta say, this looks absolutely fantastic. Pretty awesome. Yeah. <laughs> And I got the mushrooms that are sautéed in a wine sauce. Interested to see what those taste like. I'm a huge mushroom fan. Jess. I got ribs. You got the baby back ribs. Sweet potato loaded. And fruit. Because I guess they thought you are going to need the fruit. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> it good. smells fantastic. Delicious. Cooked to perfection. This looks so freaking awesome. Oh my goodness. That is delicious. I just gave Jess a bite of the steak. It's so good. Oh man. Uh, just you can get taste the steak like the, the grill. They're cooking on that wood fire stove that I showed you before. I mean, it's amazing. This steak is fantastic. I haven't had a steak this good in so long. Probably since Texas Roadhouse down in Gatlinburg. <laughs> How was the mushrooms? Yeah, I tried one of the mushrooms. Um, you can taste a little bit of a wine flavor sauce. Um, they're great, delicious. How's the potato? Very good. <laughs> uh, she did give me a bite of the ribs, and they are absolutely fantastic. Does it yeah, they just fall right out of there. So good. Delicious. As always, I wanted to show off our bill here. Uh, first of all, we had Melissa, and she is amazing. If ever you come up here to Firebirds Wood Fire Grill, it's in the Deerfield Plaza, which is in Mason, Ohio. Right down the street from Kingsley. So I got a water, just got a Coke, I got the ribeye, just got the baby back ribs. It came out to 64.13. Not too bad. This may have been the best steak I've ever had. So Firebird Wood Fire Grill. Sure. Firebirds. Lots of words. You know, it that is what attracted me to it was that it said <laughs> Firebird. Firebird. And it got great reviews and it did not disappoint. It was so good and so full. Dare I say that may be the best steak I've ever had. I mean, I've had a lot of steaks in my life, and i got to say they did it well. And there's nothing like a steak from, you know, a real grill, like a real, like, fired grill. I mean, I know you can grill steaks at home, but I don't know. There's something about people when they do them in restaurants. They just taste... <laughs> Well, it's the meat. It, a lot of it is the cut of yeah. meat that they use. If you get something from the grocery store, it's not going to be the same quality of what they're getting. How are them ribs? So good, I ate them all, and that's rare. She gave me a couple. Yeah, but still, I usually have leftovers. The only thing I brought back was my fruit, but I didn't want to waste it because it was so good. Okay, yeah, real quick, let's talk about the fruit for a second. <laughs> because I think that's a good example of what this place is. Everything is fruit. Fresh. Yeah, the, you could tell the pineapple had just been cut off of the, like they had just cut the skin and everything off of the outside of it. It was so fresh and juicy. And they, they make all their sauces. Mm -hmm. I think we talked about that earlier. Um, it, I, I, I can't talk about this place enough. I, I don't want to get all <laughs> giddy and crazy about it, but I mean, geez, I wish there was a place like this closer to home. Yeah. Uh, man, it, it is fantastic. I highly recommend that place. 
Also, Melissa was a very good waitress. Uh, that's in the Deerfield Town Center in Mason, Ohio. So if you're staying at Kings Island or you're staying up in Mason somewhere, there's a lot of stuff to do oh, here. Yeah. There's tons of restaurants around there. A lot of shopping, and, yeah. everything. Mason, Ohio is amazing. It's just north of Cincinnati. Uh, it's great. It's great. Absolutely delicious. Those mushrooms, there. I, I told Jess, I said, that I, I said, does this make sense? I said it tastes fresh and airy, like airy. I don't know. I don't <laughs> know. It's like they say they use some kind of wine sauce, and it like I feel like it really it was like a port wine reduction or something. Yeah, like and it like yeah. opens up the flavor to something like mushrooms. I've never had before. I love mushrooms. I know a lot of people. Don't. Oh yeah, the sauce on the ribs was so good, like the barbecue sauce. I was worried because, like, it it's still was a little bit tangy, like, just eating barbecue sauce. I mean, I know people don't just eat barbecue sauce, so I figured it would taste better on the ribs, and it did because it had the smokiness of them being on the grill and then all the crunchy, griddly, bristly pieces. Exactly. It was so good! Yeah, and these guys, these guys, they don't leave any stone unturned. They, mm -hmm. they cook everything to perfection. I felt like we were, like... I felt like it was a competition. I even looked over at Jess. I feel like I'm man versus food here. <laughs> <laughs> and they brought me a big, hot, wet towel so I could wash my hands off from yeah. the ribs. Or, yeah. <laughs> really awesome. So, with all that being said, Firebird Wood Fire Grill. Try it out. Absolutely delicious. Yeah. Till the next video, we're out. And always remember, the adventure is out there.